What's up guys, number one Batman here, uh, doing a let's play of a game that I played when I was a kid on the Game Boy Advance, I'm playing it on an emulator right now, it is Yu-Gi-Oh! The Sacred Cards as you can tell by the uh, title screen right there, uh, I don't know if I can fit my name, we'll try it, but it's also kind of a throwback to my old channel. Uh, with its name. I don't think I can fit that. I'll just put... Uh, um, I do not like... Oh, that's not how you do that. Uh, it's, so it's basically a, also a throwback to my old channel, seeing as how I uh, played... Uh, what's it called? Well, my name was uh, Yu-Gi-Oh, basically. So... If you came from my old channel, you'll kind of laugh at that. Uh, uh, talk about our decks. I'll just skip most of this unless, like... Uh, Batman, did you put de uh, together a good deck? Uh, sure, yes, I did. Hey, way to go. But I'm not about to lose today. I guess I'll give you guys some time to read it, but... I'll, I'll, I'll read it myself, but I won't read it out loud. Uh, and hopefully that'll be enough time for you guys to read it. Even though I am relatively a fast reader. Uh, well, uh... They're honestly not that tough, just gonna be honest. Um, the game takes a while to get started, from what I remember. Uh, but honestly, it's a really fun game. Uh, if you're a fan of like the Yu-Gi-Oh series, you you're gonna like it. Uh, when I was a kid, I was a fan of it, and I guess you say I, I still am, but I'm not really as big into it. Uh. Uh, the objective, I guess you'd say, is to beat the main bosses for, uh, uh, I guess you'd say a pink slip, just to make it easier. Uh, it's called a locator card, that's what it is. Uh, and basically you need to collect eight of them, I think it is, to win. Well, not to win, to get to the finals and stuff. Okay, sorry, it's six. Um... Alright, let's scatter. Let's get this going already. I hope it's... Um, sure. Uh, I'll be optimistic about this. Um, it, it's really crazy how, like, you, you'll see later in some of the, what's some call it says, uh, I'm honestly not even reading this, I'm kind of just skipping it, I'm sorry. Um, you get some into some life-threatening situations just for a tournament, basically. Um, I'm trying to figure out, does the clock actually change? I'm trying to remember where you need to go to actually begin the tournament, because currently right now it's not started. Um, this is Yugi's grandpa, I think? I don't know, I'm trying to remember the lore. I, I really don't remember. Um... Okay, how do I start? Do I need to talk to everybody? Nope, that's not the right button. I clearly messed up my, uh, what's some call this? My keys. Okay, yeah, you need to talk to all the main guys. To start the tournament. Uh, this guy is really easy, so. And the guy I just talked to, if I remember correctly, when you battle him. You need to battle him three times, I think, in a row and win. Fucker, come back here. Um, I think I need to talk to Yugi next. Um, Maya. 
I think that's her name. Oh, okay, and then this guy, I can't remember his name either. Um, is it? No, that's not Merrick. Um, I don't know, Ocean Dude. God, I can't think of his name, though. Uh, is there the triplets up here that you can talk to? No, just the creepy music. Oh, there we go. Good. Well, I'm balancing people. Um. Yeah. I honestly don't. Oh, people logged in. I should have signed out of Skype. Uh, I'll just quit Skype really quickly. <laughs> that was stupid of me. Why? Why would you go up there? Why not go to the place? Sorry. Again, I'll edit this out, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> um, I, she clearly hates uh, Joey. That's Seto Kaiba, if I remember correctly. God, I can barely remember these kids' names. Alright, uh, let's see. I should be able to battle people now. Good. Mm, yeah, I'll just use Shadow Spectre as an anti. Fuck you. Um, I'm trying to remember which one is the right one. Okay, I want, uh, uh do I want to bring Dark Hole? No, I'll save Dark Hole up. Oh, nope. I want this. I want this. I'm trying to remember the button. It's B. That's what it is. The turn end. Ah, oh, fuck. I shouldn't have attacked. Ah, well, I can now, uh, tribute. Here we go. I'm remembering how to play now. <laughs> uh, we'll bring these guys down. Uh, I think after this battle, I'll end this episode just because I don't want render times to get too long and upload times to get too long. So it's probably, uh, actually I'll do two battles, I think. I don't know, we'll see how it goes. We'll see how long this first episode will be. Honestly, with the way this is going. Since I'm versing noobs. Um, yeah, honestly, I'm kind of set. I'm kind of waiting for some tribute monsters to be in my hand so I can get that high damage attacks that they offer. Yes, I can just beat them with that last turn. Uh, it's kind of weird. They give you a better card than they use in the entire game. Like, see, look at that. There was no 700 uh, defense monster in their, uh, in their hand, so I don't get what they... Why they didn't use it. So I'll, I'll clear this area and then I'll end this episode. Um, I want this guy because I remember he's pretty good. I'll remember to attack uh, initially. Um, that's the problem with versing these first couple guys because you need to pretty much verse them. So you can rank up I guess you'd call it. By increasing your deck capacity and also to get the monies but it can really just become really grindy and so that kind of sucks when it becomes really grindy like there's a point where like you need to increase your deck capacity so you battle I want to say his name is Tristan since he's like a really easy battle and he's basically there for grinding and it just helps you to gain more deck capacity, but it's really slow deck capacity gain. And so it just kind of sucks in the beginning. Oh, I could have sworn I hit A. Honestly, why is there no tribute? No, I do not want to do that. Why is there no tribute monsters?
At least I'm able to kill him. I don't know, this kind of... This battle went rather quick, especially since I remembered to attack the first guy. Okay, I'll do one more. I know, I said I'd quit. See, look at that. 800 defense. There's nobody with 800 defense on in their hand. Why are you using that as an anti when you could be using it in your deck? 